Hello, my friends. We have made it out today to a little section of Lake Ray Hubbard. You can kind of see out here. Um, there's a lot of trees, so we think that might be some good cover. We're testing it out today, you know, so we might come back and do some catch and cook or whatnot. But right now, we're just setting up the little kayak and hopefully it has enough room for the two of us to enjoy a good day on the water. We got some snacks, got some Funyuns, got some hot Cheetos, some pump or uh, some uh, sunflower seeds, ranch of course, can't go wrong with ranch, and uh, see what damage we can do out here today. All right, we made it out here. This mud, you can see just our freaking tracks right here. But uh, Checking it out. so what we're doing right now is just stepping out here in the mud. All the silt, it feels so nasty. But uh, once we get deep enough, we'll lift up the back end, put the fin under it. It's getting cold. Then we should be able to have some more control. And we're going right out there to where those trees are. So I guess we'll see see how that goes. All right, here we go. Oh, dude, it's so cold now. It's a little colder, but it's also just so dense yeah. oh, like look i don't know if you can see that on the camera just every step just squishes out a bunch of mud but uh we'll just keep on walking here all right you got left i got, left. I got right. All right okay here we go we're moving everyone We made it up to this tied up tree here. We kind of have it set up, but um, now we'll just do some fishing. Just using this little Texas rig right here on this red worm. All right, everybody, you already know, the best part about fishing is when you get to break out your snacks. Mmm! I had to switch around here and enjoy each other's company. Roman's trying to get some fish, but I had an idea. If one single person on this video comments, hot Cheetos are good, we're gonna do a video where we set our hammocks up in between these trees and try to catch a fish. The key word is try. But that could be kind of fun. Roman's got a fish? Oh, oh Roman had a fish on. Dude, my drag. I hope y'all saw that. Oh man, he had a fish on. Dang. All right. We've made it to this sunken dam thing. And I gotta get out. But. Ugh. Oh yeah. There's gotta be some good fishing out here, right? There's like a boat ramp right there that we could have used instead of going like a mile up the river <laughs> yeah well it's fine because we got better better shoulder strength now anyway you know rowing this guy around the whole day so let's see if we can snag up on a fish here Oh, 
Good morning, sleepyheads. It's currently eight o'clock, not too early. Um, but because we did it. <coughs> because we did not catch any fish the last two days. I decided to wake up early on what looks to be a great day. And I decided to wake up today where I could go fishing before class. So it looks like it's gonna be a good day. The phone says it's gonna be 64. On the way over there, we got about a one hour walk all the way to where we're going today. But hopefully we can at least hook up on a few fish today instead of getting skunked again. So let's do it. This is one of my more go-to spots. So hopefully we can actually catch something unlike the last two days. But um, yeah, as you can see, it's pretty much a nice little dam here. We got a little bit of water down here on the left side, which looks like it's cleared out since the last time from all the algae. But then this is my next favorite spot. Or I guess I like this spot more than the other side, but, but yeah, this is where we're gonna be spending some time. Took us about almost exactly one hour to get here. But, um, yeah, let's, uh, let's do some fishing. Today, off the rip, we're gonna be trying out this culprit worm here um, on just a nice little weightless Texas rig. And let's see, crawdad color. So let's give this a first cast and see if we can catch anything. <laughs> got one got one we finally got a fish everybody oh yeah it doesn't seem very strong it doesn't seem very big oh he's a pretty decent one on the beetle spin oh yes that is a nice looking largemouth. There we go. After all this time, right when Roman shows up. We finally got a largemouth, everyone. Finally. All right. There it is. Is that first one? First cat, or not first cast but yeah first one on the new side or on this side and uh three days later of fishing <laughs> nice little guy say bye bye oh nice what are you using i'm using a little baby shad baby shad it looks like we finally got content oh more content oh <laughs> Looks like a pretty decent one. Jeez. Oh man. He's fighting. Is that the same one? <laughs> <laughs> it looks like the same one. There we go. There we go. Very nice. First cast. On this location. First cast for Roman out here. Clear. Torpedo back in. There we go. Let me take a look at your bait here. Using a little baby shadow, a little jig head. Very good, very good. Yeah. Where it's not very muddy. And uh. Oh, another one. There's a nice little deep spot where all they're they're all hanging out. Dude, he's swimming right toward us. 
Oh yeah. Oh yeah. There we go. Number six. Let's see. Oh. Nice little guy. You. Pretty good. Pretty good. Second gas. <laughs> Dude. Got him. I got him. I got him. There we go. Dang, you can't cast without getting a bite right now. He just sprayed me, bruh. Alright, stop. Chill. Alright. Little baby boy. Little baby guy. Okay, bye bye. Oh yeah. Now my camera's covered in gunk, but uh, hopefully will look cool. Roman just got a nice little bluegill here. Ooh. Very nice. Oh yeah. Oh yes. Yeah. Bye bye. <laughs> Dude, he smoked it. Oh yeah. Oh, that's a that's a uh, long ear. Long ear. Oh yeah. Oh. That's a pretty looking fish. Look at all Beautiful those. Fish. Look at all those colors. Nice catch, Roman. Not this thing. Both hooks. POV fist bump. Dang. <laughs> very good, very good. I got one. Got me a fish. Got me a fish. Got me a fish. No! Got it. I got him. Finally got him. Nice. Nice. Bro keeps bouncing off the wall. <laughs> Baby, I think so. It might be. Woo. Oh, my gosh! Would you look at that? Another dink. Dink of the century that's like a little fry you know you get 30 of those and you have yourself a snack all right bye bye buddy there he goes just off here in this little pocket now let's see if we can't catch one down in there. That one, that one. Yes! Yes! <laughs> Look at that. Oh yeah, that was sick. Come on. Oh yeah, let me get you guys out. Ugh. Down, I was sitting on here, standing on a log, and he bit it right down in there. Hopefully that was on camera. All right, I'm gonna release him up here so he doesn't take too much of a fall. 
All right, the new challenge, catch a fish from the top of the dam. That one's high five. <laughs> I see my bait. <laughs> oh, I got one! Oh! Boy. Oh, let's go! There we go! Challenge completed, second cast. <laughs> Alright, I'm not gonna toss him in from up here though. <laughs> there he is. He bit it too, like just right here on the, right here on the shore. Ugh. Bye bye buddy. We just got this gill. Um, wasn't really recording because we were having um, overheating issues here. But let's see if we can get this guy off. There we go. Let's see. Yep, nice little blue gill. See all that blue right there? I think that's what it is. Oh no! Oh no! Oh, well, easy release. All right. Double duck. Double fish. In Spanish, they say double V. Uh, in English, when you're fishing, double fish. Very nice. They gotta make them give it. All right. <laughs> I hope. Well. That's gonna wrap it up. This pond, this little dam right here, was a great spot. We didn't catch much on that side, but uh, after the last two days of not catching a single fish, today felt pretty nice. Roman caught 12, I caught maybe eight or nine. So, a pretty good day overall. Definitely would recommend, you know, going out in the morning trying to catch some fish. And yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Hopefully with like a catch and cook or something like that. That'll be fun. But, um, or the hammock. The hammock video will be fun over the water. I got a 58 minute walk back. And then I got to go to class. You know, upgrade my knowledge points in life. And yeah. It's a pretty good day. Hope everyone has a wonderful, blessed week.